Greetings everyone, my name is Edith Mats Josh, the Livelihoods Officer of the Refugee Coalition of East Africa. The Refugee Coalition of East Africa has been on the front in support of queer refugee livelihoods in Nairobi. Being a refugee and at the same time queer is challenging in terms of opportunities and having a daily source of income. Refugee Coalition of East Africa, in conjunction with ORAM, have supported a number of refugee-led livelihood projects in Nairobi. This has seen a big improvement in lives of those queer refugees that have been involved in livelihoods when a refugee livelihood project is supported. It gives a life back to be able to support themselves and their loved ones to have a sense of belonging just like other people and to improve on their on their skills as they await resettlements. Thank you. Hi, I'm by name of Mark Mwevale, a queer refugee in Nairobi. I'm part of Team No Sleep, which is a queer lady refugee organization. Be Behind is our project at Team No Sleep Safe House. Uh, this project was founded by our Olam through Refugee Coalition of East Africa. We found poultry farming to be easier to do since we had enough space and it kept us more inside the safe house. Mostly for our transgender members. This has really improved in our living. We use money for we use money from the cells to cater for medical emergencies uh, that is food and sometimes to add on our lent. We want to take this opportunity uh, to thank our uh, ORAM and Refugee Coalition of East Africa. Thank you. My name is Dean Stride and I'm a member of FLBQR, a queer organization in Nairobi. I'm a refugee. Um, in our organization, we do different kinds of things, but one of our projects is crocheting. Like you see this handbag, we made it through crocheting and this sponge as well and also we do crafts like this and necklaces and uh, bangles and also bracelets in this project th these projects that we do they help with our livelihood and also help to cover sometimes our rent and also keep us busy and keep us stress-free because of the situation that we live in, in as a queer person in a country that is homophobic so most cases we are at home and we're not, we, it reduces our pressure that we live under and also it helps us take away our stress. So these are part of the bags that we make. They're so beautiful. I think very many people like them. And also this one as well. We also have this and this. And all oh, this is... At, uh, a decoration you can use to hang around your house and also this is our best table mat um, we make varieties of these in different designs and we also use these sponges you know um, very many people very many people prefer such sponges so we use this as a big market you know and then these are the table mats different table mats for different designs, different choices, different color choices. I want to take this opportunity to thank ORAM and Refugee Coalition East Africa for supporting us. Thank you for your great work. <laughs>